Hey y'all, it's your girl Shugs and I am back with another video. Hey girl, hey. So today, we're gonna do a little DIY. Um, hopefully I don't uh, destroy what I'm about to do. Um, stop! See, that's why I can't have nice stuff. So I found this planter, planter, potter, whatever, in Hobby Lobby. Um, cause the vibe that I'm going to do for this little corner is going to be really cute. I hope that's big enough now that I'm looking at it, but we'll see. Um, but all the ones that I've been finding, these little things are like 30, 40, $50. And then these are like 10, 20 altogether. I got this for 39 99. So I am going to probably stain, well not probably, I'm going to stain these because I don't like this light wood color. I want them a little bit more, um, Either a little bit more like rustic grayish or just straight up espresso. I'm not sure. But I love the color of this. Um, I think it goes, the plant that I plan on getting, um, I just need like six centimeters diameter, whatever. Six, six, six inches. Talk, Shook, talk. Um, so that should be big enough. We'll see. I don't plan on buying it right now because I told myself that I wasn't even really spending any money this month or at least this these two weeks because I've been doing the most but <laughs> I walk outside and I spend money lately um so yeah so today I'm doing a little DIY um I've been really into like abstract looking art um and I need something to go on this big wall um but abstract art paintings or whatever are like dumb expensive um so i bought some canvases can buy um off amazon they're being delivered today they're just not here yet let me see i don't think they're here yet but yeah they ain't here yet but um, from the video that I saw or followed or whatever. Um, so I'm going to need some plaster. Um, I just got two of these. I think they were six something each. Um, some command strips because for some reason I just really don't want to put holes on my wall um, over there. So I'm going to hang them up with command strips. Um, I got this little thing that uh the putty knife to you know spread it on there or do whatever and then after you put the plaster or the spackle or whatever on there and it dries then you paint it so i have these colors um it's in linen i'm going for like a tannish off whitish color on the wall um because i have you know tan pillows or whatnot that's kind of the scheme the color scheme i'm going for so i've got two of these um and then some paint brushes uh, the oh how much are these so like I said both of these were six something um, this was a dollar and these were ten dollars each so that's 20 32 35 so this is forty dollars and then um, the canvases I bought um, I want to say the sizes are 16 by 20 they're not too big but they're big enough and I'm gonna do six of them staggered or not staggered but stacked um it came in a pack of 14 for 24 dollars like you can't beat that um so yeah i will be doing that today um it is two o'clock and my delivery time was by 4 45 so that means they'll get here by like six <laughs> um so yeah i will be starting that tonight and i will check back in with y'all once i start All right, y'all, so the canvases are here. So at first glance, I was like, this thing said 14. Like, y'all are lying to me because, you know, but they're really thin, which I'm not mad at that. Um, but that also explains why it was so cheap because they're thin. So them thick canvases, I probably could have only got like four for this price, so. 
We're gonna start with the first one. Let me pull up that little video I was watching. Oh. watch that blue therapy child that man paul was a hot mess a straight narcissist i'm so glad she went about her business um yeah okay so this is the video i'm summer, watching all right, guys. All right. Her name is Abby Ephid. Child, I don't know. Um, Another little DIY. So let me just go over this again real quick. This is my huge canvas. This is that. Actually, before I even do this, wanting to work this wall. Like, I like it. Okay, well, we just want to do this thing, child. Um. Like I said, I think I'm gonna do six of them. Oh, come on down. Let me bust my tail. your stuff all over this house like that sir actually let me go get my ring light for y'all all right so first we're gonna take our um our spackle this is by the brand the dry decks um i use this one whenever i moved out of my apartment and i had to like put hole like fill the holes in from where my tv was mounted the reason I like this one is because it um it goes on pink and when it's dry it shows white. So we just we just gonna do this thing. Get back, sir. And I definitely want to add a little um texture once I get the pink on all the way.
got my peaches out in Georgia, oh yeah shit I get my weed from California, that's that shit I took my chick up to the north, yeah, badass bitch I get my life right from the source, yeah, yeah that's it And I see the way I breathe you in It's the texture of your skin I wanna wrap my arms around you, baby, never let you go And I see the it's nothing like your touch It's the way you lift me up Peaches out in Georgia, oh yeah shit. I get my weed from California, that's that shit. I took my chick up to the north, yeah, badass bitch. I get my life right from the source, yeah. Alright, y'all, so it's the next day. Um after I stopped talking in the last video, I know I said that I was just gonna let three dry and then do the other three other three. Well, I'm so glad I did not because this stuff took so freaking long to dry. Um I ended up painting one of them. Because it was the only one that didn't have any more pink in it. And this is what it's looking like. Um, it still has a, it dried, this dried really quickly though. This paint dried very fast. Um. It still has a few white speckles in it. So I'm going to go through. You can't tell it looks white on camera. It's definitely cream. Let's turn this down. Mm, can't tell. Um, it's definitely cream. It's given white on camera. Um, but it's very much giving... Um, Kanye West trying to sell you a ripped shirt for a thousand dollars, which may not be a bad thing. Um, but yeah, so I'm gonna touch up these couple of white spots, and then I'm going to go ahead and paint the rest. I'm probably gonna lay out some um, trash bags or something in the garage and let them sit out there because I'm be real mad if coconut walks over one of these and I got footprints everywhere. So yeah. All right, y'all, so I'm finished. Um, I'm honestly not sure how I feel about it. Um, I don't hate it, but I don't love it. Um, in real life, you can you know see the texture on it and stuff. So, I don't know. Um, I obviously, well, maybe not obviously, but that's my pillow that I like lay on the couch and lounge on. So, that doesn't actually go on the couch. These two pillows do that are cream colored. I'm going to get another big pillow to sit behind both of them. Um, initially, I was going with navy blue to match the accents. But I think that I just want to do another cream color. Um, I don't know.
I don't know. We'll see. So all together, um, I didn't use this and I only used one of these. So that's like $17 pre-tax. So close to $20 that I'm gonna get back. Um, so all together, this only cost around $50 when one of these large pictures themselves start at like one something. So I think that's pretty good. Um, we'll see. I can take them off the walls because I use the command strips. Um, if I want to eventually add more color or something to it, I can do that too. Um, but yeah, I'm not going to show my face right now because I have the meat meals going on because I'm about to put a wig on. Um, but yeah, thank y'all so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and comment below and I hope y'all have a great day.